morning guys and welcome back to my channel. I actually felt like kind of getting myself together and getting dressed and doing a little bit of makeup today and so I hope you guys enjoyed kind of coming along with me as I got ready for my day. Um, I'm still, you know, just kind of wearing comfy clothes that I can wear around the house because as you guys know we're in quarantine. I'm a stay-at-home mom so I got nowhere fun to go but I still like to get dressed up even though like even if I stay at home sometimes because it just makes me feel you know, more put together and a little bit better about myself and just not like, you know, a slug that wears pajamas all day every day. So this is the outfit that I went with. I've had this shirt forever and I don't remember where it's from, but I absolutely love it and I feel like I don't wear it as much as I should and it actually fits a little differently than it used to. Um, like way, way back when I was, you know, in my early 20s and weighed a little less, it like came down much farther. But I really like how it fits now. It's like more of a shirt and it has these bubble sleeves and yeah, it's like less of a tunic length and more of a just long shirt length. And so I really, really like how it fits since that was a pleasant surprise. Um, and then I'm obviously just wearing black leggings and then slippers because I'm still a mom. <laughs> um, and yeah, so for jewelry, I actually got a few new pieces in from my absolutely new favorite jewelry store. You guys have heard me talk about them a couple times before, but they are from Ana Luisa and I absolutely love their jewelry. They have all of these beautiful pieces of fine jewelry that are sustainably made, which is what sealed the deal for me. I absolutely, you guys know that I'm really passionate about making sure that kind of going forward, everything that I consume and um, just my general lifestyle, I try to really be sustainably focused and conscious. And so I love being able to buy things, even like my jewelry, from a company that has those same values and is focused on sustainability. So, um, you guys saw in the last set of jewelry that I got from them, I got some pearl earrings and they are freshwater pearl earrings and so obviously those pearls are sustainably harvested and so you don't have to worry about any harmful impacts on the environment from your jewelry choices, which I find very, very important. Um, so yeah, all of their jewelry is handcrafted and very nicely made. I'm going to get you a close up of all these pieces because they're gorgeous. These earrings, oh my goodness. I freaking love them and I've wanted them for so long so I'm so excited to finally have them. It has a little tiny moon on this side and then a little tiny star on this side which like I feel like is totally just right up my alley. It's so cute and dainty and sparkly but also just kind of like you know a little bit of that hippie nod in there. <laughs> and then I got this adorable like dainty double layer necklace that I am absolutely obsessed with. I've wanted like a necklace like this for a long time as well and so I'm just I can tell I'm gonna wear this all the time. This is going to be my go-to staple necklace from now on. It's just so beautiful. It has just kind of a simple circle pendant here and then the little dots along the shorter chain. I just, I'm absolutely in love. And finally, the last thing I'm wearing is this gold little ring. It's actually um, resizable so you can kind of open it and close it to fit on whichever finger you want. But I've really been into rings lately because obviously I'm a mom and so I've found that rings are the easiest piece of jewelry to kind of wear on a regular basis that Stella won't really like be able to break. I won't have to worry about her like, you know, pulling on it or breaking on it or chewing it or whatever so I can kind of let her mess with my rings. And in addition to this, this ring is really nice because it doesn't have any sharp edges so I don't have to worry about like scratching her while I'm taking care of her. So. Super, super appreciate that. So once again, I absolutely love all the pieces that I got from Ana Luisa and I highly recommend you check them out. They are very high quality. They're fine jewelry with like, you know, gold plating and real, you know, freshwater pearls and diamonds and all of that, but they have price points available for everyone. So as low as like $39 for some of their pieces, they're very reasonably priced. So I definitely recommend you go over and check them out. They are beautiful. I love this jewelry so much. Not only is it like perfectly my style, but like I said, the brand is just, a brand that I can fully stand behind and rave about and I love their values and their business practices. So yeah, highly recommend you check out Ana Luisa. I'm going to leave a link down in the description box below and I'm going to go back out in the living room and join Miles and Stella. Good morning, Stella Bell. You want to say hi to all your friends? Say good morning and happy Sunday. Are you having a bottle with Dada? I see. Wow. Oh, thank you. Very nice. Oh, and the cap too. <laughs> You know, you want it back? <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> We're definitely in the pass it back and forth phase. That's not for babies. Thank you. You want some more? Yum, yum, yum. What should we do today? Huh? What should we do with our day today? Oh, we should play with your bottle lid. That sounds like a fun idea. 
Should we go outside maybe? Take a walk around the neighborhood? Yeah. Look how long your hair is getting. So impressive. Where are you going? You silly girl. Yeah? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Hello. What are we doing? Huh? <laughs> We're going to leave that on the table. Oh. What would you like? Thinking about it? Get the wipes. Excellent. Excuse me, ma'am. Hi. <laughs> well, oh, that's loud. That's very loud. Ma'am, where's your pants? <laughs> lost them. You lost your pants? Lost them. Oh, my goodness. How embarrassing. Well, actually, I think you guys never gave them back. We never gave them. Oh my! We are very excited this evening. Oh yes, there is your pants. Correct. We oh. found our pants. Daddy's making lasagna, and he told me it's just a different type of spaghetti. Oh. So I'm really excited because I really like spaghetti. We having spagooters? There's your Thank pants. You. Correct. Would Did you, you find like them? Put them on. Hi, Munchkin. Come on. Do you want to put your pants on? <laughs> you are being a wild child. <gasps> oh, Dakota. You being a grump. Come on. What's that to have? Wow. That looks like fun, huh? She looks like such a cool kid. Just like leaning on our table. Are you a cool kid? <laughs> Hi. Yeah, go get them. Go check it out. <laughs> Their little naky legs with those shoes. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> and all the tissues that she has pulled out of our tissue box. Tissues do not stay in a box in this house. No, they do not. They're meant to be all over the floor. <laughs> Good job. Where's your hammer? See, we were playing with it earlier. I don't know. It's probably under the couch. <laughs> All right, guys. It is the end of the night. We're downstairs in the basement. We've been, you know, ending our nights, obviously, in the basement like we do. Or like we have done for the last, I don't know, how many years of our relationship. But, um, yeah, Stella's in bed. I have a glass of wine tonight. That is so, so good. We, like... I mean, never get a chance to drink just because it's kind of inconvenient for me as a breastfeeding mom. Um, and so I just, we never really like open bottles of wine because they, you know, don't get drinking, drank, drunk. I don't know. I swear I've only had half a glass of wine. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm still waiting for Miles to join me down here. And so I thought I would kind of just hang out and chat with you guys while I wait for him. Um, Stella is in bed. She was kind of a goofy tonight. She... Like we put her in bed like we normally do. We did her whole nighttime routine, laid her down and she was like quiet in there. And so I opened up the monitor, like the little camera monitor that we have on her, expecting her to see t her totally passed out. And um, she was just awake in there for, it was like 25 minutes after we put her down and she was still just kind of laying in there, like playing with her little hands and just looking around. Like it never takes her that long to fall asleep. And it, like, she never just lays there <laughs> like that waiting to fall asleep. It was just really funny because I opened the camera expecting her to see, like, expecting to see her totally. My gosh, I really, I am, like, literally half a glass of wine in and I feel like I'm stumbling over my words. Shows how much I drink. <laughs> um, but I was opening the camera expecting her to be, like, fully passed out in bed and she was just, like, 
just laying there quietly like with her little hands clasped. She's been doing this thing where I can't really do it because I'm holding the camera, but she, while she's falling asleep, she like kind of holds her own hands and just kind of like, you know, rubs her own hands. It's really, really cute. Um, anyway, she's asleep now and we are about to start our evening. We've actually, um, for a while we were watching, rewatching the Grimm series. We really like that show. So if you're looking for something good to watch, that's not really like super popular, you may not have heard of, we definitely recommend Grimm. It's a really good show. Um, and so we have been working our way through that series again, much slower this time because we only ever have time for one episode a night now that we're parents. But um, Miles had a new video game come out this weekend. If you have a boyfriend or significant other, husband, girlfriend, wife, whatever, who's into video games, you probably already know. But I'm pretty sure it's Call of Duty. I'm probably going to get made fun of for not actually knowing that, but I'm pretty sure it's a new Call of Duty that came out. And so... Um, in the evenings after dinner, Miles has just been kind of taking that opportunity to just sit down and be able to like, you know, play a bunch on his video games because again, we're parents and so he can't really just, you know, play during the day when a new game comes out for him, you know, he can't like sit down and play for a long period of time, you know, which obviously you want to do when something that you enjoy comes out. So yeah, he's been doing that and I have been rewatching Scandal, which I absolutely love. I love Scandal, so I've been really enjoying rewatching that show. It's so just like, it's so good. Um, and yeah, so that's just kind of what we have been doing with our evenings. Now I think that just kind of wraps things up. Um, I'm gonna probably end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up if you did and I will see you guys in my next vlog. Good night.